Hi, this is Brad Linder with Little Cubing, and I'm here at the uh, Logitech area, and I'm taking a look at a couple of new keyboards. We've seen uh, you know, a variety of keyboards for larger iPad-sized tablets, but now with the 7.9-inch iPad Mini, Logitech has a couple of new uh, keyboards as well, which work with that. So we've got here a folio-style case, which has a magnetic cover here. And sort of works as a complete case. It's a little hard to open with one hand here, but there we go. And then it sort of snaps into place again using magnets. And then there's also this guy here, which is a sort of ultra thin case. Um, and you can actually just pop it right out, use the magnets in the back, and then sort of closes much thinner. Now, what's different here though is that there's not room for a full size keyboard. So the keys are a little bit smaller, it's a little bit more like using. Uh, one of those original netbook keyboards with a seven inch uh, uh, screen kind of thing. Um, you can type on it, it takes a little getting used to it. I'll send you the console. I'd say you can even touch type on it because there's a nice little sort of chip out style keyboard here with space in between them. Um, about $79 for the uh, the thin keyboard, about $80 or $89 for the uh, the model with the folio case. And then Logitech also recently introduced $100 versions for the iPad of both the thin keyboard and the folio keyboard. This is Brad Linder with Lilliputing.